Hey Creekside, I'm Shelby. I'm Sterling. This isn't our normal newsroom. We're filming from Huntington Beach, California. This is Kaden. <laughs> Hey Creekside, I'm Mrs. McClure, I'm the TV production teacher, and I am here to introduce to you our STN Nightline. STN is the Student Television Network Convention, and I took 13 of my advanced students to Anaheim, California, and they competed in seven contests while we were there, and I'm here to introduce to you those videos. I'm Hannah Kalish and I'm Jacob Moss and our contest was convention recap and our prompt was something different. We had two days to shoot and edit a video recapping the whole convention showing from the pro sessions to the opening ceremonies and everything in between. All right, here's our video and we hope you enjoy it. Anaheim, California home to the 2017 Student Television Network Convention. STN is home to the world's future filmmakers and video journalists who aspire to shape the future of this industry. Here, people with different backgrounds and passions come together to create their own story. Un mundo, nuestra historia. En vald, min bersalta. Han sezang, urie yagi. Un sol mon noche histoire. Adin mir, nash historia. One world, our story. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm Eric Palmer. I'm Logan Fisher. And our contest was commercial. And the prompt we were given was a selfie stick. Um, our prompt was um, to try and create a commercial for people by Exories. Um, some things that we didn't have was the adaption for the selfie stick. So we had to be, able to be a bit creative on what we had to do. And another difficulty was they gave us music we had to use and we couldn't use our own. And that's really tough when trying to create a commercial, so. All right, enjoy. The Me Shot, stainless steel, three feet long, super durable. The Me Shot is perfect for all your documentary needs. Exories, accessorize, innovate, entertain, and create. Hey guys, it's Shelby Weiss. And I'm Molly Weiss. And at STM, we did a music video. We had two songs to choose from and one of them was really bad, so we picked the other one. Um, we had six hours to do it, 
three hours to shoot, three hours to edit. And yeah, I think the highlight of this video, Molly, is watching Camden sing in a cowboy hat. Probably, because even though we had three hours to shoot, we didn't shoot enough. <laughs> so yeah, have fun watching this. <laughs> we did. <laughs>
a photographer. I'm abundantly talented. <laughs> <laughs> as a teacher, you from early sometimes you spot, as she said, that people do things effortlessly. It's just they feel comfortable doing it. And as they grow, those talents multiply. So as you get old like us, you'll find you have a whole package of talents. One can have an, a talent for people. One can have a talent for, well, of course, the normal things that we think about when you think about talent, athletic skill, musical, and so on. But one can have, have a talent, anything that one does well, without having to learn it from a book or whatever, is a talent. I'm Maximilian Merkley. I'm Jack Cunha. And our contest was short story. Our prompt was just one day. We had six hours to come up with our idea, film, and edit. We had a few problems along the way with filming, but everything turned out pretty good. We just had one camera, but we made something we both uh, are proud of, so here it is. Yo, what's up, Kyle? How you doing, bud? I'm good. I'm gonna miss you when you go off for do. Yeah, I know, I can't wait for the last Oh, day. well, we're gonna have a blast though. Let's go. Let's go. What's up, Creekside? I'm Dwight Dominguez. I'm Camden Padgett. I'm Kyle Miley. And at STN, we participated in the movie trailer. Kyle, tell them about it. So we had about six hours to film. And uh, what was our prompt, Camden? Our prompt? Really complicated. Incognito. Yeah, so we ended up uh, coming up with this idea about uh, a student. And this other guy was like kind of watching him through Skype. Uh, so basically, we ripped off Unfriended. and. Uh, Kyle, I, I don't remember. How did we uh, how did we end up doing? Um, I think I can't shoot. Do you did, remember? Did, did you I don't know. Canada? I think it went something like this. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. We won uh -huh. second place, but it was it was a win in our eyes. Yeah, it was it was a miracle on ice. The underdog. <laughs> miracle on ice. So I, mean, uh, I spent most of my time in the gym while they were editing. Yeah, kind of two editors were right. allowed to go. So yeah, and then really I found good. a basketball court. You know, I had pretty fun, but you know. Anyways, hope you enjoy. Thanks. Hey, is it hey. working? Yeah, it's working. How are you guys doing on this project? Didn't start it. Wait, hold on. I got this. Just I got this weird friend request. What the heck? Hey, wait. I think I got. It. I think I got one too. Yeah, Does yours say right. unknown? Yeah, mine says unknown. Who are you? On our first day of the convention, our biggest contest is the Crazy Eight. 
Crazy is when you have eight hours to plan, shoot, edit, and turn it in on time. Our contest was a short fiction film, and our prompt was Tomorrow the World. Our prop was an Earth stress ball. And we had a really good time working all together, and I hope you guys enjoy the video. doesn't come from what you can do. It comes from overcoming the things you once thought you couldn't. Today, conquering dreams, injuries, and interviews. Tomorrow, the world. 2017, STN, glad Kyle could make it. Yeah, I'm actually just kind of surprised that I came here. Um, you know, I didn't really show up to any of the meetings. I didn't even show up for the practice Crazy 8 film. I didn't get any of the text messages, you know, Miss McClure said she sent them to me, but I highly doubt that. STN is a whole new world. I'm not even kidding. The kids here, this is what they, this is their passion. So, to, like, seeing kids literally staying up late, waking up early, always having a camera on their neck, literally, like, coming, getting in your face, trying to get these close-ups, not even what I was expecting, but I feel like part of something bigger than I even knew what it was. STN is like crazy. Uh, it was so much fun going across country to uh, do you know something that like I really enjoyed. This was just a week and it was just doing something that I enjoyed and then I was with other people that enjoyed it and it was just a great time. So this year at STN was really fun. Uh, we went in not knowing each other really that well. All of us were kind of like outsiders of each other and we actually learned to like 
we learned who each other were and we actually made a really good connection and it was really fun. And STN was a very good experience for me. Um, learned a lot, had a lot of fun. Um, the video didn't turn out as quite as I expected, but for one camera we did really well. This has been one of the most amazing, educational, fun experiences of my high school career. Like. I have made, like, everybody has clicked so well. We've all, like, become good friends, like, and it's just been amazing harnessing those, like, video skills. I love our group this year, too. Everyone's great. There's not a single person I don't like, like, at all. Everyone's awesome, super nice, great to get along with. We all work really well together, and that's also a big bonus to this trip, and it really adds to it. Being with, like, cool people that you can, like, connect with is awesome. I went last year. Uh, and I thought it was really fun, but this year was like way better than I think last year was because we bonded like way more than you know we did last year. We came here with a lot of people, um, a lot of them are good friends of mine, and I made new friends on this trip too. STN was fun, and I truly made more family than friends because, yes. I had some friends coming in, but at the end of STN, I felt like we all came together as a family. The experience for STN was one gigantic roller coaster, really. My experience at STN went amazing. Um, it went way better than I expected, just bonding with everybody and creating videos. Everyone had a job in each video. It was just awesome. I'm really happy with um, the fact that everybody finished their videos on time. I know that they may not think that was a big deal, but that's a really big deal. It was a really fun trip, but I'm happy I came. The contests were really fun, and my contest was great, and I really liked how the video turned out, and yeah, it was just a really fun experience. My project that Sterling and I did wasn't too bad. Um, it was a nap package like you guys probably have already seen by now. Um, we had to go on the street and ask people like, Hey, what's up? Do you have a talent? You want to show it? Put it in front of the camera? We're strangers. We don't know you, but I mean, come on. Why not? You know? And we got rejected. Not once. Not twice. Um, maybe for a good hour or so in total. And every single one of them said, Oh, no, 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 sorry. Eh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm, I'm running late. So getting rejected, like, opened up my eyes. I now know what it feels like to be a boy when he asks for a girl number and she says no. One of the shots that we wanted to get was me trying to get hit by a car. Well, we didn't have a car. I asked a stranger to run my friend Dwyer over with a car. <laughs> she <laughs> looked at me funny. Um, I had to explain that I didn't actually want him to die, that it, it was only for a video. And we got a, a lot of weird looks, and uh, it ended up not happening as people got really confused, but it was, it was just hilarious. We overcame these obstacles. We got ourselves together. We hugged it out, we produced a great video that we are proud of, and I wouldn't have done it any other way. I feel bad, like, coughing in the middle of the night. Like, it's not my fault, it's like the allergies, and I feel really bad. I woke up 4.30, 4.30 a.m. thinking, like, okay, like, day's about to start. Everyone's, like, asleep outside, and, like, me and my roommates, me and my girls are like, dude, what's going on? The party bus was really cool because I thought it was funny. Like, he kept saying party bus, and I wasn't expecting that at all. I was expecting, like, a charter bus, and it actually was a party bus. My shoe fell off on the escalator, and I tripped over my shoe, and some kid got it on camera. I didn't want to leave the hotel, so like an hour before we started to go, I lay down on the couch, fell asleep, tried to fake that I was dead so I could stay, and that didn't work, so... But just to stock up on snacks, we went to a CVS. So basically, the whole time I've been at STN, I've been eating this box of cereal. <laughs> <laughs> I think all the videos turned out wonderful and I think everybody's proud and happy with their videos and so am I and whether we win or not, good job.